Today is November 16th, 2016. Maybe the most interesting day in stock market history. Now, that being said, we haven't hit tomorrow yet. Tomorrow might be the most interesting day in stock market history. So uh, what I want to focus on today is not even necessarily a particular play or plays. I mean, I assume everybody knows the shippers are, have gone wild. You know, dries went from $4 to a high of like $120 and then halted. Every stock you can see on my gainer scan is a shipping company and they're up from 50 to 80 to 200% in one day. Crazy, crazy opportunity. I haven't shorted a stock in months and I am never been happier about it. So what do I want to focus on today? One of the best and most powerful things about stocks to trade. Um, this is a little bit of a commercial, but it shows how valuable our constant iteration process is. Okay, Going back to the spring when we saw the low float trend coming, I was adamant that we build float into every area, every screen, everywhere in Stocks to Trade, you can filter by float, you can scan by float, you can see the float quickly. That's what's working right now. I don't know if it will work a month from now or next year, but look up tickers like Dries and GLBS and Sino and, and DCIX and let me know if you think there's opportunity in low float stocks. So every percentage gainer scan has float you can turn on. High a day scan. I can quickly add a new column, go to float, and now I've got the float in my high a day scan. My watch list, I've got the float. I can turn it on and off. Um, if I go to a particular ticker, I've got the float right here, right in front of me. If I run a screener, every screener has float criteria that you can add to it. So whether I'm looking for the next hot sector, like say energy or something else, and I want to see all the low float stocks that are moving, I can do that. So that is, again, an awesome feature that we have, the, the float built in across the board. It's a, it, it's a core feature of the platform. And, you know, we added it just a couple months ago when we saw this trend come. So that's the kind of constant Kaizen, constant improvement we're always striving for. So thanks a lot, guys, and we'll see you tomorrow.